Well, I've always loved the arts. As I've grown older, I've come to appreciate them a lot more. I think it's something that makes you feel one with other people. It makes you a wonder about yourself and your community and your life. I am not, I'm not an artist at all. And in fact, my mother made every effort in the world <laughs> to have an artist daughter. Uh, she gave me uh, dance lessons and that didn't work very well. And then she gave me voice lessons, but my voice teacher said, you got to quit cheerleading or I can't teach you anymore. And I, I couldn't quit cheerleading, so um, that didn't work. My husband Jim and I went to uh, East United States and we ended up in Charleston. And there were people in the streets and everyone was happy and people were smiling and cheerful and the merchants were even happy. And we said, you know, what's going on here? And they said, well, it's Spoleto. Well, I'd never heard of Spoleto, but they have 65,000 ticket holders and it, it's a two and a half week art festival. And I said, well, what do you think about having a Spoleto in Little Rock? So we went to the mayors of North Little Rock and Little Rock. We went to the county judge. They all said, it's a great idea, let's go for it. We had a number of people say, well, I would love to volunteer and be a part of it. And we had one or two people that really stepped up financially to help us. So we were on our way, and that was in 2013. And we're in our fifth year now. We have dance, we have performing, all the performing arts. We have a lot of music. We work with the symphony and the repertory theater and the art center here. Uh, we bring acts in from New York and Dallas and Chicago. There's a lot of different kinds of art and we want people to experience those. I feel like we bring people in from out in the state and from out of state and more each year. And you know, they're all so surprised. They love Little Rock, North Little Rock. Uh, you know, and they say, God, this is just a great community. I didn't know about it. I've never been here, but we'll come back. So uh, that's kind of exciting for us. But I really dream that, that a Kansas leads the way to making Central Arkansas and Arkansas itself an art center for the community and for the nation. Well, fundraising really is an art, and it's, it's, I guess, the only art I practice actively. A lot of people say, well, you know, how do you always ask people for money? Well, I don't ask people for money. I give people the opportunity to be involved in something important to our community, important to our schools, our children, our seniors. It's, it's such a wonderful opportunity, and everybody feels good right here when they've given and supported something that's worthwhile for our community. And it's just nice to look at somebody and see a big smile on their face when they've enjoyed something.